Oh, hi! If you're like me, a bored schlump who wants to share his boredom with the internet, then you need a blog. In fact, you need more than a blog. You need a vlog. You see, a vlog is a combination of the words video and log. <laughs> but you probably already know that. So I'm here to tell you what not to do when making a vlog. So you have the sporadic interest to just put your boring life on the web. And with a vlog, you can do that. But you might as well do it in style. When you start out vlogging, you probably want to look your best. Save the pajamas for when you get about 10,000 subscribers, then no one will care. Heck, people won't even mind that you got stains on your shirt. The same exception goes with hair. I mean, having great hair is probably a necessity on the internet. Unless you're bald, no one likes listening to baldies. In watching a vlog, you have to be careful of where you put your camera, or where the camera is. You don't want a shoddy, shaky cam- Get back here! You don't want a shaky look, or else people are gonna think that you don't care. And you probably don't, you just want them to watch your video. Also, uh, making sure you're not watching the viewfinder at all times, and, uh, keeping the camera too- too close to- the, your face, that, that might hamper your, your viewer intake. Remember, viewers are the lifeblood to YouTube. Lighting is also an important factor. I mean, the sun gave it to us for a reason. Why would you want to film in the dark? I mean, unless you're one of those cool creative types who likes to use the TV light to illuminate your face, but hey, I don't know what I'm doing. The same rule goes for outdoor lighting. Don't use it in a vlog, it's really fucking annoying. Everyone loves animals on the internet, but uh, it's probably not best to film your sarcastic evil cat, you know, when you're trying to make a vlog, talking about something important because people will be too focused on your born fucking cat. Ain't that right, Julius? Asshole. You are probably aware of what a jump cut is. Try to avoid using them. Also, be sure to learn to be a You want to have some kind of energy or something when you're on camera because people are going to be watching and if they don't care because you don't care then no one really cares i mean do you care you're watching this right now i mean fuck how long can you be watching me and not really care because i don't care right now i don't care for this fucking scene like this this little segment here you know no one's gonna care about some other you know vlogger who's gonna talk low and and mumbled keep her words straight too i mean no one's gonna unless uh but no, no, no. Your audience is gonna care as much as you, so you better have some fucking energy. You better get loud or something, so. Oh, and by the way, you know, when you're really bored and you're vlogging because you've kind of given up on life, no one's gonna want to hear about your stupid fucking cat. I'm just gonna throw that out there. On that note about energy, you might want to limit yourself because no one's gonna watch you act like a freak on camera! <laughs> Well, I hope this helped. I mean, there are plenty of vlogs out there about how to make vlogs, but those are like, you know... Better. You can watch a vlog about what not to do. Follow these tips, and you'll soon make the front page of YouTube. I guarantee... something. Be sure to like and subscribe and favorite this video. Tell all your friends. I need views! <laughs>